Hello everyone and welcome back to our channel. Today, we will be talking about China's latest technological breakthrough in the field of lithography machines. For those who are not familiar, lithography is the process of creating microchips that are used in a wide range of electronic devices such as smartphones, computers, and even cars. It is an essential technology that enables the creation of advanced electronic devices. Recently, China has made headlines in the tech industry with the announcement of their latest lithography machine, the Xinhua 3. This new machine is said to have the ability to create chips with a feature size of just 3 nanometers, which is a significant improvement from the current industry standard of 5 nanometers. So, what makes the Xinhua 3 stand out from other lithography machines? Well, one of its main features is the use of extreme ultraviolet EUV, lithography. This technology uses a shorter wavelength of light to produce more precise features on the chip, allowing for a smaller feature size. Additionally, the Xinhua 3 uses artificial intelligence to control the process, making it more efficient and reducing the chances of errors. The impact of this new machine is enormous. With the ability to create chips with a smaller feature size, electronic devices can become even more powerful and efficient. This technology could be used in the creation of advanced artificial intelligence systems, 5G networks, and even autonomous vehicles. While this is undoubtedly an impressive feat, it is worth noting that there are still some challenges that need to be overcome. For instance, there are concerns about the reliability of the machine and the impact it may have on the environment. Additionally, the development of this technology required significant investments in research and development, which may not be feasible for smaller companies or countries. China's new lithography machine uses extreme ultraviolet EUV, light instead of traditional light sources. EUV light has a much shorter wavelength than traditional light, which means that it can create much smaller patterns on the silicon wafer. This allows for the creation of microchips with more advanced features and higher performance. The machine also uses a new type of lens called a freeform lens. Traditional lenses are limited in their ability to focus light, but freeform lenses can manipulate light in more complex ways. This allows for even more precise patterns to be created on the silicon wafer. The Xinhua 3 lithography machine is developed by China's Semiconductor Manufacturing International Corporation, SMIC. It is a significant upgrade from their previous machine, the Xinhua 2, which had a feature size of 7 nanometers. The Xinhua 3 uses EUV lithography, which uses a wavelength of 13.5 nanometers to produce more precise features on the chip. This technology allows for a smaller feature size and is considered the next step in the evolution of lithography machines. The development of the Xinhua 3 puts China in direct competition with other leading semiconductor manufacturers, such as Taiwan Semiconductor Manufacturing Company, TSMC, and Samsung. Currently, TSMC is the market leader in the production of advanced chips, with their latest machine capable of producing 3 nanometer chips as well. However, China's domestic chip manufacturing industry is heavily reliant on imported technology, so the development of the Xinhua 3 is seen as a significant step forward in achieving technological self-sufficiency. Impact on the Semiconductor Industry The development of the Xinhua 3 has the potential to disrupt the global semiconductor industry. It could enable China to reduce its dependence on foreign semiconductor technology, which has been a major point of contention in the US-China trade war. It could also challenge the dominance of companies like TSMC, which currently has a significant market share in the production of advanced chips. Developing the Xinhua 3 was a massive undertaking that required significant investment in research and development. SMIC invested $10 billion in the project, which shows China's commitment to becoming a global leader in the semiconductor industry. The Chinese government has also made it a priority to develop the domestic semiconductor industry, with plans to invest $1.4 trillion in the sector over the next five years. As with any new technology, there are challenges and controversies that come with the development of the Xinhua 3. One major concern is the environmental impact of the machine. The production of advanced chips requires the use of toxic chemicals and generates a significant amount of waste. The Chinese government has promised to address these concerns and has set strict environmental standards for the semiconductor industry. Another issue is the reliability of the machine. 
Developing a lithography machine capable of producing 3 nanometer chips is a significant achievement, but it remains to be seen how reliable the machine is in mass production. It is also worth noting that the Xinhua 3 was developed with the help of Dutch company ASML, which is currently facing export restrictions from the US government. The US government has expressed concerns that ASML's technology could be used by China to develop advanced military technology. In conclusion, the Xinhua 3 lithography machine represents a significant achievement in the development of advanced semiconductor technology. Its successful development shows China's commitment to achieving technological self-sufficiency and becoming a global leader in the semiconductor industry. While there are still challenges and controversies surrounding the machine, the potential impact of the Xinhua 3 on the global semiconductor industry cannot be ignored. It will be interesting to see how this new technology shapes the future of the semiconductor industry and the broader global technology landscape. Thank you for watching.